This is why you need to know about crypto tax forms. If tax season makes you break out in a cold sweat, keep watching. We've got you covered. All right, let's dive into the wonderful world of cryptocurrency taxes. First up, Form 8949. This bad boy is where you report your capital gains and losses from crypto trades. Sounds fun, right? Not really. Then there's Schedule D. Think of it as Form 8949's partner in crime. It's where you summarize all those gains and losses. But wait, there's more. If you've got crypto income, you'll also need Form 1040. And let's not forget about the FBAR form if you're holding crypto overseas. Now, if all of this sounds like alphabet soup, you're not alone. Doing crypto taxes yourself can feel like deciphering ancient hieroglyphics. Here's where CoinLedger swoops in to save the day. CoinLedger makes crypto tax preparation a breeze. It helps you track, calculate, and report all your crypto transactions without losing your mind. So, if you found this video helpful, give it a thumbs up and subscribe for more crypto tips. Got questions? Drop them in the comments. I answer all of them. Happy trading.